glaucoma actually refers to a spectrum of uh, many diseases, about 40 diseases in all, all unified by the fact that they damage a structure in the eye called the optic nerve. And the optic nerve is the neural connection between our eye and our brain, so it takes the information that our eye gathers back to our brain. That structure, the optic nerve, is damaged in all 40 types of glaucoma uh, in a variety of different ways, and, and our job as ophthalmologists is to uh, prevent that destruction because we can't repair the nerve, at least not yet. Uh, we can't repair it, so we have to try to stabilize it and prevent further damage going forward. The damage actually usually takes uh, months, years, or even decades to accumulate, and so we're seeing patients uh, uh, through their 60s and 70s and 80s because uh, it's usually a disease of, of aging. Glaucoma can present even uh, at birth. Uh, there's forms of congenital glaucoma. Uh, there's also forms of uh, juvenile or early onset glaucoma that hit in your teens or uh, 20s and 30s. By and large, most types of glaucoma though are diseases of aging that happen later in life and are picked up later in life. In terms of symptoms or knowing that you have glaucoma, uh, the problem is early in the disease, with rare exception, there aren't any symptoms. And so it's not until damage is done that people begin to perceive uh, deficits. So let's talk a little bit about the risk of glaucoma. And uh, the main risk is probably genetic. Uh, and so if you have a, a first degree relative, a sibling or a parent uh, or a child that uh, has glaucoma, then, then you definitely should be checked. Uh, so, knowing your, your risk factors, uh, black Americans are much more likely than white Americans to have glaucoma, probably four to six times more likely. Um, and so, trying to accumulate the risk is the best first step. The, the second is just being seen, uh, being seen by an eye care professional. Um, you know, it's recommended that by the age of 40, everybody have a complete eye exam. Eye exams, uh, school exams are probably not enough. Uh, you know, just knowing that you have pretty good vision is probably not enough. Um, and so by 40, everybody should have an eye exam, and probably after that, about every two to three years, you should have a complete eye exam. Because so many diseases of uh, vision are slow in onset, uh, they won't be picked up early by you, so you have to be seen from them to be picked up.